Welcome back to a game that is 12 years old now. Isn't that isn't that impressive? Here we are, folks. You've been clamoring for it. We've been getting emails every single day. Where's Metal Gear Solid 4? When are you going to play Metal Gear Solid 4? When are you going to do Metal Gear Solid 4, guys? Wait, people when are you going to fucking do it? People use emails? We've been getting them constantly, dude. And finally, here we are. We're going to play and mostly watch this game. <laughs> uh, yeah, we're doing it. This is our favorite of the Metal Gear games. and uh, Just like my penis. Solid normal. I thought it was going to be liquid small. <laughs> I can't high-five you because of the coronavirus, dude. <laughs> Here we go. That's better. <laughs> That's going to be the running theme throughout all the show. I always like these things. You know you can change channels during this. Yeah, I know. But well, I like David Hader. You want to watch David Hader? Whoa! Body of armor! Whoa! Kitty one. I never understood. I never understood these. Because I don't think... like they, It's like they don't exist within the context of the game. They're just like little things that you can watch. Yeah. Yeah. And they only come up here at the beginning. That thing's a deadly thing. You don't want to tell... You don't want to fucking... You don't want to fucking fuck with that. Serious tale. No, they hold all eight arms. Ew. <laughs> That's just <laughs> Ew. Oh yeah, this is like a who wants to be a millionaire type. This guy always reminds me of your dad. Yeah? Yeah. Just with a more wrinkly face. Yeah. And a fatter face. Uh <laughs> Is B. <laughs> you fucking suck. Well, I'd have to say my dream project. Let your dreams. Fuck you. <laughs> I do like nanotechnology. Is there an Easter egg with these? Yeah, I believe there is. I don't. I don't remember what it is. I don't either. Oh yeah, this one I always liked. So like that, that the, fucking is that robot. The yeah. yeah, the mantis. But yeah, they're all, they all kind of have to deal with like the different PMCs in the game or something. Yeah. Because the one's the mantis one, the one's the octopus one, and then I forget what the other ones. What is it, Raven? And, yeah, Raven and um, uh, Wolf. Yeah. Yeah, that was an ad for the PMC. <laughs> huh? Part 66. I don't know what part that is, but it, it's a part. There it is. <laughs> We're finishing this shit soon, guys. And, uh. And not too distant future. We got, a, we, we got a, a special treat for you. become routine? It stinks. <laughs> oh, yeah, that was kind of the thing with this game, too. Was like, I, remember, I just watched a video on Mother Gus Out 4 recently about, like, kind of its creation and stuff. And um, this was, I think, the first game that kind of had, like, the handy cam, shaky cam type yeah. thing, thing going on. I think it was, it's anyway. More, it's more real. Yeah, but it's... I can't believe that this game came out in 2008. It's still pretty. Like, it's... Yeah, it still looks amazing. Like, the cinematography and everything. Like, just so much detail went into this game. Like, it shouldn't have come out on, play, on PlayStation 3. <laughs> yeah. And at the launch... Yeah, so right. I, yeah, right, dude. I remember this is what was being played. Yeah, that's what when sold fucking, the... uh, yeah. When we got the PS3. It was this and Rock Band. Rock Band's cool. I wish I could go... I wish I could, like, play Rock Band without having to buy all the shit again. We've, uh, we've been playing it again. Dennis has it. Jimmy has it. Next John time, has it. Next time you guys are doing it, let me know, because I'd like to do that again. Okay. I miss playing that stuff. I just don't want to invest money in it. Yeah, no. 
especially now because it would be a lot more expensive. Because I remember, yeah, well, Dennis was like way into it. He had like all this shit, didn't he? Mm-hmm. He had like all the packs and everything. Like, yeah, that's like hundreds of dollars, if not thousands of dollars. Yeah, he ended up rebuying a whole bunch of stuff because he uh, lost his well stuff. Yeah. When you see David Hayter, you never assume that he does this voice. Yeah, I know. Because he just looks so... Unassuming. You know who he looks like? Um, who's that one actor? <sighs> He's in 1408. What? Um, the movie 1408. I've never seen that. Um, John Cusack. Oh, he yeah. He kind of looks like John Cusack. Mr. Sack. I don't know. I'm thinking of John Cusack, and I don't know if he really looks like him, but whatever. <laughs> pull, pull up a picture of David Hayter. You know who John Cusack looks like? And pull up a picture of John Cusack. You know who he looks like? Who? Joan Cusack. What? <laughs> his his uh, fucking mother? No. She's an, act- she's an actress, too. She was the prince related? She was the prince. Yeah, I would assume so. Yeah, so she was, she was the principal in School of Rock, Joan Cusack. Is that his mother? His no, sister. I, I'm assuming it's a sister. I really have to fucking look up John Cusack right now. Yeah, John Cusack and Bill Hader. Bill Hader. <laughs> now is Bill Hader and, and David <laughs> Hader related? <laughs> Probably not. Check it out. I'm gonna look this up on my smartphone. Wow, Taylor. Came into the future. Oh, God, fuck. No, first I'm gonna look up Joan Cusack. Oh, I shot three bullets and I'm done. It's a cheap ass gun, that's why. She's married to Richard Burke? Who the fuck is that? Who's Richard Burke? I've never known. Jeremy Burke? No. <laughs> yeah, wow, he's really gotten uh he's really gotten up in the world. Marion Joan Cusack. I mean these fucking PNCs are ripping these guys up. Yeah, right. But I mean this was like the worst assault ever. That's fucking like, they didn't even Joan try. Joan Cusack. Oh yeah. That's fucking John Cusack's Gumpy ass wife. Yeah, John Cusack is her brother. Okay. Alright, alright. I, I actually booted this up and played it for like three seconds earlier, and the controls are like a little wonky again. You gotta kinda get used to them. Yeah. I think, uh, okay. I think the sh- L2 and R2 do your inventory again, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. yeah. And then our L1 is the aim button. So if you hold down, that's when you get a gun and all that anyway. Uh, R1 is your attack and all that shit. So all the CQC is done with R1. Uh, X is the crouch and the dive and all that. Circle reloads. Square, I forget what that does. Because this game, like, completely changed the, the, uh... Yeah, the loadout. Control, well, the control scheme, yeah. Like, it's completely different. It's, like, 100% different than what it was. Man, why don't they remaster this game? That'd be dope, wouldn't it? Yeah. And I, I mean, like and by remaster, I mean, like, literally just, like, maybe optimize it so the frame rate's a little bit steadier. Yeah, that 4 k of it. Yeah. yeah. That, would, that would take forever. Yeah, I'm rolling in the deep. Oh, I got a fucking wise notification because... Oh, I'm Maycam. Oh, shit. What about Baycam? That's when this is Cam. Oh. Let's like, see. is she a cam? No. Cam girl? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, her camera's off. Really. I'm not going to turn it on. I'm not going to look. We both have the USB cameras hooked up. Mine's up there. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay. What I did is I, I let it play while me and my dad were laying floor in here. Mm-hmm. Um, so I'm, so I, you could uh, time lapse? I, there was a time lapse function, but I didn't do that. Um, I just let it record. 
Um, so what I'm going to do then is I'm just going to, I sent a couple bits and pieces to myself and I'm just going to like edit those into like a vlog video later. So this game introduced so many, oh, excuse me, this game introduced so many new mechanics. Like if you notice that your stress goes up, but if you go in the shade, it goes down. Yeah. Like shit like that. It's like so many like systems at play that I don't even, you know. You don't even know where to begin. Yeah, well, that's why you don't just stop in the middle of the goddamn road, dude. What are you doing? So they're not even fighting for anything. They're Well, technically they are. They're fighting for some territory. I guess. But, <laughs> but it's not it's, really worth it. But it's not territory. like... But it's not like they're fighting over ideology or anything. They're just, like, fighting. Yeah. Well, I'm sure there is more of a backstory on why these guys are fighting. Yeah, it's because it's the war economy. That's why. <laughs> Everybody's fighting, so then they have to buy more weapons and shit. <laughs> Everybody, get this, ready for the cows. This opening is pretty sweet. Like, this is, like, even though, like, there's tiny little pieces of gameplay interspersed with cutscenes, like, this opening is fucking dope. Yeah. <laughs> right here. It's like, what was that? Kaboosh! It gets fucking knocked in the face. Destroyed by this thing. I like this motherfucker falls on his ass and he's like, oh, yeah, shit. Oh, my shit. He's in my pants. Oh. And then you finally start oh. shooting. <laughs> Big doo-doo in my pants. <laughs> These things are dope, too, man. Fucking rhino will kick its ass. <laughs> Who would want to fight a rhino or a hippo? Don't tell me what to do, motherfucker. Yeah, fuck you, bitch. Excuse me, excuse me. What was that for? Ooh, a gun. You just snicking? You just snicking with snaking in there? Just heading some north, you know. I don't want to fucking deal with these bitches. <laughs> oh, dude, it's so cool, man. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, you did it. Good work. That was awesome. Dude, that, part, that part is great, dude. It is. I fucking love this part. This, this never made any sense. Like, how come it's all quiet all of a sudden? <laughs> yeah, I know. After all the fucking mayhem. Yeah. Let me pull a cigarette out so I can smoke to my death. I hope nobody bleeds on me. What the fuck? What did I just fucking think in my head? How did you not notice it's standing there? Yeah, I know. I swear that wasn't there in the last shot, but alright. <laughs> Whoopsie daisy! <laughs> You can tell when it's coming because it sounds like a cow. Why did they make the gecko sound like cows? Who I fucking don't know. That's knows? a fucking question, man. Animal theme stuff. That's yeah, just what they I don't do. Know. Anything, whatever. I believe it's old stuff. you hit the shoulder buttons when those come up, it shows like the fucking uh, mocap dude. Like the credit for who did the mocap or something. I don't know, man. Yeah. And then I think another button shows you the Japanese voice actor. See, I like that kind of shit. How come like no other games do that? You could have used that gun still. Yeah. Ooh. That's to be expected. <laughs> How are you going to get up here? I have flippy arms. And this thing is like, fuck you, bitch. Moo. Those things have got such cool design. I wonder if you can undo it by shaking the controller. Probably not. I think this. 
I think this looks good too. <laughs> well, that's the thing you can do though, because that's how you reset the camouflage. That's how you reset the camouflage. Yeah, I don't think it'll do it now. Because this is scripted. And like every other cutscene, because it's real time, um, if you have a certain camera pattern and if you shake the... Um, if you shake the controller, it will turn off the cam, the camouflage. Squish it! Stupid robots. Ew, come on guys. Gross, why'd you shit? <laughs> I never understood that. I still don't. I think part of it is like them getting called back or something, but like why do they like piss green stuff? Like what is that? Maybe it's to show that like... Yeah, it won't do it for this part. Yeah. Maybe it's showing like uh... They think this place is clear. So they piss? Yeah, so they mark the territory. Oh. Uh, This is the one song that Jimmy learned how to play on guitar. It's not. It doesn't sound that hard. Just a couple of, just a couple of strings, a couple of little twangs. You know, put your finger in some holes and then just go wait, wait. Is that how you play? It? You don't put your fingers in holes on guitar. I don't. <laughs> Unless you're playing a different kind of guitar, I don't know about. But yeah, the whole finger guitar. The whole finger guitar. <laughs> All you need is one finger for this guitar. <laughs> Just one. You stick your finger stick in the hole, one and then it moves along the strings, and yeah, it's underneath it. It's on slides. Perfect, perfect note every time. What is what is he doing? Checking for booby traps? I guess. No, oh, there's a name underneath it. Shit. Oh shit. <laughs> Good job. Yeah, you know what, Kojima, you gotta love him. I want, you know, like I, I will, I will say, uh, having some time to to stew on Death Stranding because uh, I was super super hyped for that game. Konami sucks. <laughs> um, I uh, I don't know. I th I would like. Did you ever want to go back to that or no? You can save over that one, I don't care. Um, I don't know. Because you still haven't seen a whole lot of it. Like, no, I haven't. Like, you haven't really gotten to the point where the game opens up. Because it's a cool game, and it's just, like, it's just one of those one-and-done games, you know? Yeah. Like, I don't really see myself going back to play it again, which is kind of the disappointing thing for me. But, whatever. I mean, Mitch still says it's one of his favorite games on any console ever. Mitch Strom. Oh, of course he would. And I'm just like, I don't get it. No. Nah. Like, well, he likes those games where you just fuck around, and I, I don't. Really yeah, but like it's not even like that. fun for just fucking around. No, it's not. It's not really. <laughs> um, I'm glad he liked it a lot, but I'd, I'd give it like an eight. Yeah, I'd be like you know. I gave good. it a seven, I think. That's fine. You still have to see like a lot of the game though, because it definitely like the first few chapters like are are very. Uh, kind of bare bones in terms of what you do. Yeah. Once you get to a certain point, the game really opens up. Like, I like some of the concepts, and I like, you know, the intrigue of the world and all that, but at the same time, not not everything's the greatest. Yeah. I always, I, after I've played it and finished it, I'm like, this is like a good foundation if they were to make a sequel, you know? Yeah, see, there's the motion actor. Um... Yeah, they got enough systems in place where they could make a great sequel if they explored it more, but... I'm always excited to see what Kojima works on. The, thi the thing with Kojima games, though, is that like they're so big that it takes them forever to make a game. <laughs> yeah. Like, him and his team, like it takes them fucking years to put a game together. Because I love this shit. Like, Metal Gear Solid 4 is fucking dope. But God knows it took them fucking forever to make it. And plus, yeah, PS3 was not the easiest system to develop for, from what I understand. Yeah, no, it wasn't. Oh, 
It's a good song. I like I like Old Snake. It's a good song. Yeah. I'd make love to it very slowly. Just like this right here, like seeing him old is like, man, it hits you. Yeah. Now I think imagine you're... that in 8K graphics. That's what I'm saying. Like if you if you got this so like running 60 FPS at least. Yeah, like high res, like higher res shit, you know. Who are you? Colonel. Play the fuck. Because right here, he's only like, what? 40 something, maybe? Snake? Uh, probably not even that. He's probably not even 40. Yeah, he's like 30 something. I think. Let me look it up. Let's look it up. Who is it? Kudo Takishi. <laughs> That's how you pronounce it, right? Yeah. How do they know exactly what I'm trying to look up? Snake was born in 1972. Well, that would make sense because of the way I'm going to read the project. Yeah. And MGS4 takes place in 2014, so he's 42. Okay, so yeah, he is 45. He's 42 in this game. 42, but he looks like he's 70. Yeah, right. Or at least, you know, like, late 60s. Foxtrot. Shut up! Shh! I'm trying to watch a movie! <laughs> yeah, right. He's preparing to unleash his insurrection. Insurrection, more like my erection. Forty-two. That's the... What did Melissa do? That's, that's the age... Of the universe. I wonder who who's thingy. I wonder whose decision it was for him to have a mustache. His decision. <gasps> uh, who? Snakes? Snakes. Yeah. He's just like. But I mean, like the like you know when they the were designer. designing the game, yeah. What? Two eggs to paradise. Two eggs, that. two eggs to paradise. <laughs> she fucked that left egg. Yeah, she did. Broke that yolk. I'm pretty sure that's live action. I mean, it yeah, has to be, right? Yeah, it is. You know why they call her Sunny? She makes eggs. Because she's got that sunny disposition. Ooh, that would make sense. Doesn't she die? Or who? Who's the one? Who's the one in? Uh, no, that's Olga. Yeah, that's her mom. Yeah, that's right. Look at that taut old man ass. <laughs> it's the suit. It's the suit that does it. Sunny and I built it. 
The Mark II will provide you with a map of the area, as well as any battle situation data. You should find it before you do anything else. Okay, got it. I miss these things. I thought they did the codec really well in this one. Yeah, it's not that intrusive, though. Like, they don't do it a whole lot. Yeah. Octa Camo. Advanced Camouflage Suitability Octopus. Where lies. Doesn't move when pressed up a wall. Suit imitate color wall. Ground surface both naked. Infrared sensors. Fucking Issa, shut up. <laughs> well, Issa Poopo. Am I right or am I right? You're not answering me. Sorry. Am I right or am I right? Melissa is having a problem with one of her assignments, so that's why I'm. Oh, yeah, I really like this part of this one, too, where you can help the PNCs or you can help the resist. Yeah, that was the cool thing in this game. I mean, there's no real reason to help the PNCs. I think they shoot you no matter what. Yeah, they end up shooting you no matter what. Like, they won't shoot you in this area if you help them out long enough, but, like, yeah, it's... It doesn't help much. R1, if you want to CQC, grab him or whatever, yeah. Whoa! Oh, Jesus Christ, you got fucking jacked up, dude. You are not in good shape. <laughs> They'll never see me. You're gonna die, homeboy. <laughs> Don't tell me what I'm gonna do. <laughs> Escaped. Yoink. 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 Oh, <laughs> my dick. The same thing kind of applies as before with in Snake Eater. If you yeah, if you do that and then wiggle the stick. Uh, oh my god, dude, you're getting fucking jacked up. There you there go. Is. Stress is going crazy. Give it, give it. Give it, give it. White phosphorus. Oh. <laughs> What's this thing? <laughs> <laughs> All right, now let's not get hit by the APC. That's uh, that's the thing that wrecked my fucking puss. Just go. so, Billy, let me. I got a question for you. Yeah. She's got a video assignment to submit. Okay. And she says that. Everything sounds loud and clear on her iPad and on her phone. Okay. But once she uploads it to Google Drive or to file on desktop, she can hardly hear it. I think the audio is quiet, I guess. Well, you're, how is she trying to listen to it? I guess in VLC Media Player. VLC Media Player. Has she checked that the Media Player hasn't, like, uh... Gone to some kind of uh I think it's gotta be something with the playback, like just whatever the output is. Yeah, that's kinda what I was thinking, like the uh the playback is causing it to like just lower its um sound. Yeah. It might still be fine. Arsenal compress. Oh no! What a that was a terrible death. <laughs> he got shot so many times. <laughs> he just kept living. <laughs> Cease living. <laughs> All right, let's 
let's see what we can do here. Have a dip do how do you do 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 who do 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 Sorry I'm not engaging much, but this is kind of something. Yeah, that's a it's a thing. Yeah. I pushed him around. Seem a little quiet, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, lo, 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 lo. This part you're just getting the feel for the game anyway, right? Yeah. I want that white phosphorus. Let me try saving it, maybe. Can I save it? How do I save this? There we go. Let's try that. Save it. Mm, I know there's stuff that I'm missing that's in here. Are there don't. like lockers and shit? Yeah, I checked the lockers. It's like behind some boxes or something. Is that it? There's a thing. Oh, that's more five, five, six, yeah. It's probably like a nudie. Dooty patooty. Whatever. I got still knocked out. One, oh, three, oh. Are you gonna are you gonna be the naked statue man? Yeah, of course. <laughs> you gotta be you naked grab statue. His, you grab his penor. <laughs> That's good shit, man. Country, gonna eat me a lot of peaches. Nothing. Oh, it's you. Do I look like Baxes now? Am I a Bax? I don't know what the controls are for that, if it's like, yeah, what they can do. Yeah, I wanted to kiss, like I used to be able to. What happened to kissing lockers? All right, are you ready to get your pussy reamed? Welcome back, you bunch of slots. I mean, this is the same episode, shut up, what? Welcome black, you bunch this of This game has so many good options for, like, how to sneak. Imagine how many, like... I wonder how, like, the technology worked for them to get the, uh... Textures of the environment to be on your character. Yeah. <laughs> you remember, remember when my nephew was, like, right before Metal Gear Solid Five came out? He's like, yeah, they're probably gonna have the, the Octo Camo, like, in 4. And I'm like, nope, nope. Why would they? He's like, yeah, but, but they already have it in the game. Why would they not have it? I'm like... Because that's what games do. Yeah, because they didn't fucking... Because it doesn't make any sense in the, sense, you know, in the, in the world. Yeah. You fucking idiot. You fucking dumbass, you bitch. We should fuck him up. 
I got a compress. Do you know what that does? Um, keeps me cool. Yeah, it makes it so your stress will go down. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, shit. Oh, oh. <laughs> you're basically right where you needed to go, too. And then if you if you crouch long enough, his, his back starts to hurt. Fucking Jesus. I hate typing on this fucking phone. Oh, you bitches, how did you see me? Excuse me, excuse me. Oh, my dick. Yeah, just go right through that door. Oh, you're about to die. Holy shit. I made it. Don't worry. You did it. I got that cool compress. That was a <laughs> that was a, a pure victory. Stopped a bullet right there. <laughs> just during the cutscene, they, <laughs> they come they come over. And just <laughs> I got the anti compress bullet. Look at those little wheels. I remember this was like one of the like. OG like trailers for this game. Yeah. They edited it a little bit, but. Sorry to keep you waiting, Snake. <laughs> Do you get it? <laughs> Sorry to and keep what, you waiting. And what game did that start? <laughs> I mean, I don't fucking know. I don't know either. Whatever. Fuck it. It looks like Metal Gear. I'm at home. <laughs> I'm not going out there. <laughs> That's creepy. Rips his eye out. <laughs> Everyone likes a nice eye patch. Here's a condom. Oh, God, how's that gonna help me? <laughs> Protect yourself. You gotta fuck the enemy in submission. I see that. I like that one. I shot a pistol like that. Yeah. It wasn't that one, obviously. But a close. Of course. Close comparison. <laughs> like this. I dab dance. You scared? Yeah, that's what he does to sneak. <laughs> Alright, I got this box out. Mosquito hits me. Oh, you have full health now. Oh, yeah, nice. Our two pistol operator. I'm, I'm, curious to see, I'm curious to see how you handle with this game because this is unlike the uh, past couple ones we've played. Are we going to play Better Solid 5 after this one? I don't know. About Go that. from like great heights to absolutely crushing lows. <laughs> Just get fucking wrecked. Pig. Shoot that fucking dude. I will. Fucking shoot that dude. I fucking will. If you go, if you hit triangle, you do the iron sight. Oh, yeah. You shit! Oh, 
I like this too. Like that's another thing they had in this game that none of the other ones had. Like the little like colors next to their health bar or whatever is like their mood. Like they never had that in any of the other games. No, they did not. Press circle. To reload. There you go. Man, that fucking Ooh, that frame rate's rough. Yeah, that's the that's what I'm saying. That that'd be the one thing that'd be nice if they like did a re release of this game is just the the frame rate being steadier would be good. Doesn't even have to be like super high, I'm just saying, like, you know. This is why you don't just hang out in the middle of the streets. It gets rough out there. Yeah, this is always really cool. I always like this type of stealth in a game, and not a lot of games do it. Where there's like, you're like a neutral party in this conflict, you know? Yeah. Jesus Christ. I'm sure he's fine. <laughs> oh my god. I'll take that. You just watched that man die. Yes, I did. Oh no. There's an RPG you can get somewhere. Yeah, it's over here. Is, is it? Can you use it yet? I think so. I thought you have to use the do the ID lock thing. Maybe you can't use it yet. Oh, well, you can still take those dudes out. Oh no, it's back there. There it is. Oh, it's not locked. I think you have to go. I think you have to press start. Press start. You got to go to weapons. And then you gotta set the RPG. Oh wow. Okay, so they have an RPG that doesn't have the ID lock. Oh, you only got one shot with it. Though. Yeah. You can make it work. Oh god. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. It's, I did it, guys. it's kind of crazy, actually, when you see this game because, it, or like when you play it, because it's like you have like a lot of really good actual like combat. Like the combat's really good, and the stealth is really good. See, I love playing it online. Yeah, the online was sweet too, wasn't it? I forgot they had an online. The online was a lot of fun because there was a whole bunch of different shit you could do with it. Yeah, I it wasn't just like. Oh, you know, team death matches or something like that. Yeah. It was actually yeah, they yeah. had some intricacies into it. They had a. Uh, I remember playing subsistence online all the time. I love that fucking shit. I was terrible at it, but I mean, I'm terrible at all online games. Yeah, I remember the multiplayer was pretty sweet in this game, and it was even more fun because of the fact that the online mode was was a uh, free back then. Yeah. You're dead. He's on fire. Yes, he is. I think there's a mortar up there somewhere. You can use the mortar to blow some more dudes up or something. Oh, maybe that's later. That's later. Yeah. Yeah, this is just a that, PM. That, that's another APC thingy up there. You don't want to go up there. <laughs> See you later, guys. <laughs> Wait, can I be yeah. friends with you? Isn't there friendship things I can do Yeah, with I think you? it's maybe when they're not in combat. That would be my guess, anyways, that when they're not in combat. I'm gonna save this man. Take him prisoner. <laughs> prisoner of love. I wish that they had an opportunity to make this game again, or something of this style. Oh, yeah. Because, like, the one, like, the one issue with this game, at its core, is just that there's not a lot of gameplay in it. <laughs> yeah. And I, mean, I, I still like it for I, what it is. I still like it too. I mean, it's like probably like I know it's over the top and like kind of cheesy and goofy. Like like in so much, there's so much fan service in this game, but like okay, that's kind of what makes it fun is that there is so much fan service and it's so self aware how fucking ridiculous it gets by the end. Because sometimes that fan service is actually like it's so much fun. Because there is a lot in this game. Excuse me. There's sorry. like an obscene amount of fan service. Yes, there is. <laughs> but 
Mainly again. snake's ass. Well, that... He's got a camel toe, also. Yeah, <laughs> But I just mean, like, the wild shit that, that goes on later on. It's not that dark. No, it's really not. I always wanted in games where they actually make it fucking dark. But it's not that dark. But I'm friends with you guys. So yeah, you're friends, so you don't even have to sneak anyway. What are you doing here? I don't think I think they they got rid of the option to interrogate people in this. I think uh, I'm pretty sure. I don't think you can interrogate people in this game. I don't remember. I don't think you can. Because uh, I guess there was less of a reason for you to be able to do it in this game than there was in the other ones. But I don't know. Give me that. That's the way I believe I have to go. So. Go the other way real quick. Yeah, this this area's got a couple nooks and crannies. Cranny nooks. Nooks cranny. It's my favorite store. Are they doing a new one of those? Uh, yeah. Fucking animal crops. Yeah, animal cropping. Yeah. Oh, there's another RPG here somewhere. Uh, fucking what's it called? Animal Crossing. I would, you know what? I'm still kind of at that point where, like, I, I wish I had a Nintendo console, but I just I don't want to fucking spend money on it. <laughs> no, thank you. Because it's not worth it for me, man. It just isn't worth it. Like, I I would be interested in checking out the new Animal Crossing, but I don't. I'm not gonna pay money for it. No. <laughs> I know John's getting it. Of course he is. He, he buys everything Nintendo. Yeah, John's a, a fan. Boy. Because I remember I saw her, I looked back at Animal Crossing in my shelf, and I'm like, are you meaning to go this way? You're going backwards. Oh, yeah. I remember seeing it, I'm like, that game was fun as a kid, but there's, like, nothing to do in it. <laughs> like, it doesn't hold up now, because there's literally nothing to do in, in the I game. I mean, there is, but it's it's busy work. Yeah. That is what you were doing. But I mean, it came. It comes to a point too, though, where like, you know, the storekeeper dude like would like stop telling you like things to do. Yeah. Yeah, I I don't believe it's a fine. It's got finite. Oh yeah. Absolutely. So guys, the battery on your thingy's almost out. My. God. I just don't want. I just don't want to miss anything. Oh, no, I don't want that. There we go. No, you'll be fine. What is that underneath there? What the fuck is that? Oh, you can get the box. That's how I thought it was. How do you get a box by crawling on top of it? <laughs> you just absorb it into <laughs> your being. Grenade. Grenade, grenade, rocket launcher. Yeah. Full oh, grenade. <laughs> fucking shot up. White phosphorus grip. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Oh, sweet white white phosphorus. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I I was just thinking about this too because I and when I I popped this in earlier. I wanted to make sure it was installed because this game takes forever to install. Yeah. Um, I wanted to just hop into it and see that it was all working and everything, and I did. And I just remembered that, like, between the acts in this game, they have the mission briefings, which fucking take forever. Yeah. It's just, like, an hour of cutscenes, like, all right, cool. <laughs> like, do I need to know all this about what uh, Liquid's up to or an Ocelot or whatever? Like, do I need to... Oh, yeah, there's the RPG. They have all this background information on shit, I guess. I don't know. They call me Liquid Sauce a lot. I mean, it, it is part of the story. That's kind of what makes this game, is the story. But yeah, if you're not here for the story, well, then you're really not here for it. Yeah. I remember this being a big hit when it came out. Oh, yeah. I remember people, like, really were into it. And at the time, like, I still hadn't gotten a PS3. I'm like, eh, whatever. 
I didn't get a PS3 till 2011, something like that. And uh, from there, it was all downhill. I remember we were so like... Uh, meaning that I loved it. Yeah. My brother and I were so much into like, we want the Wii! And then, like, the PlayStation 3 came out. We got that instead of the Wii. Yeah. And we were like, oh, this is so much better. Fuck the Wii. <laughs> yeah. I like Twilight Princess. I think it was good. Wrong button. Twilight yeah. Princess was a good game. I like that game. That was probably my favorite game for the Wii. Was, uh... What are you doing? You want the... Disguise or something? Yeah, where's my hair? Change costume. Yeah. Here you go. Oh, yeah. Old snake. <gasps> Sexy snake. You used to be able to download shit. I don't know if you still can. Uh, you might. I mean, it, should, it would be on the main menu. I don't, yeah. I don't know if they still have that, though. Yeah. So we had some games that were alright, I guess. I was telling Fabio, he just got a, a PS2 from one of his buddies or something like that in a couple of games. <laughs> yeah, he got it for like 10 bucks. So, oh. and he, I don't think he, you know, I think he's hesitant to buy his kids video games. His son just turned six. That's uh, understandable. He's, he's hesitant to get them video games because he doesn't want them to become like addicted to them. Well, as long as you actually pay attention to your child's. That's what I say. Like, you can do it, but just be, like, like anything. Like, in moderation. Like, yeah. like hey, all right, you can play for, like, an hour or two. And that's it. Yeah. You know? Then, Especially when they're young. Because I guess his son's, like, fucking obsessed with fucking Minecraft. Well, I mean, all the kids are. But, like, he doesn't even play it. That's the thing. He only watches it on YouTube. He doesn't yeah, actually play it. all the kids it. love it. He just watches other people play Minecraft. That poor monkey. Okay. Hey, <laughs> this would be so suspicious if I saw a fucking monkey with a couple of machine guns laying there. <laughs> He's got the gun pointed on my key. <laughs> Looks nice, doesn't it? <laughs> he fucking startles him. <laughs> oh, my monkey! Oh, he's like Gray Fox then. That's what Gray Fox said, didn't he? Yeah. Oh, my balls! Yeah, so you ain't got that chip ID. Yeah, I take him to a laundromat. Tell me it's gonna be a dove. No! Oh shit. <laughs> Why is, why'd you make it an apple and just throw it away? He's Frank Drebin. <laughs> He's a fuck bitch. I'm running around. Oh, she's tearing up my bed right now. Hi, 893. Kudo, Kudo, Takashi. I'm allowed to pronounce these names because I've been to Japan. Yeah. That was cool too. Like they did, they did this in five, I think, too, where you could customize the weapons. But I don't know. I like the way they did it in this better. Yeah, me too. The M4, the official carbine model. You don't need to tell me. I know. So maybe it's the answer. Yeah, right. 
where they spelled it the classic internet way. Tap X, tap X. No, this is not one of the ones where I'm going to let you do it. If you tap X when his stamina goes down, you can recover it in the cutscene sometimes. Oh. This one, I think it's a hard set one because he immediately gets it back as soon as he can fire his load. Yeah. <laughs> After all, scripted burp. You know, this is actually becoming a real thing now. What? ID locks on guns. That only the person who has the biometric can actually use the gun. That's good, I guess. Is that good? I mean, it's the same problem as with, you know, uh, what you call it. It's the same problem like they're having in this. Where, yeah, that's good and a bad thing. Because, you know, yeah, right. it makes it so... Fucking, uh, people can't take up guns against, you know, people who, uh, who are oppressing them, governments. Yeah, right. So should we, we should just move to Israel or something. I like Anacon's sweater. I like how pixelated the screen is. That's cool. Yeah. Sonny's been doing a little sleuthing for us. Sleuthing. Dreaded, a well-known gun launderer in war economy circles. He's a businessman who deals mainly in some black market firearms. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Just because he's black doesn't mean everything's that black market. That is fucking racist, Otacon. Placing the ID recognition chip with a counterfeit version. This enables you to bypass the ID recognition process and use the gun. The problem is that there's still a record of the chip being replaced on the system side. Dredden's an employee of AT Security. He must have connections on the inside erasing records for him. You think the Patriots are involved somehow? I'm not so sure. <laughs> oh, sorry, yeah, I should have said that first. <laughs> Remember, Revan's a green collar. He makes his living off the war economy. He doesn't let emotions get in the way of business. They never really explained that, did they? The Lily Lily Low part? No. Because when it happened in number two, you're like, what? Why did he say that? Lily Lily Low. Lily Lily Low. Lily Lily Low. That should have been the name of my band. Fuck. Imagine chanting that for an encore. Omelette au fromage. It's a cream and cheese omelette. Yes. I have already. See, this system was cool too. This was a cool system. Yeah. Gives you a little cash for actually, you know. Like taking part in the battles and not just sneaking around them 100%. Yeah. That was neat. And then they ruined it, number five. <laughs> they went back to the Peace Walker way of doing it, which is terrible. Let's be real, it was shit in Peace Walker and it was shit in Metal Solid 5. Yeah. I get why some people like Metal Gear Solid 5. It just, I, it wasn't a good Metal Gear game. No. No, I don't. I'm not. I'm not a fan of it. I don't like that it has. Because it became like a fucking Ubisoft game or some shit. Like it wasn't. It just sucked. And we'll play it. <laughs> we'll play it. All I got up to was the getting that bub the, bumblebee or whatever the fuck yeah. we'll call. We'll 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 do it. <laughs> and then I'm like, and we're gonna dumb. we're gonna do it. We're gonna try to do it the right way. That'll be that should be our goal if we ever play that fully. We already did Metal Gear Solid Five Ground Zeroes. We have to do Phantom Pain. You know, once we're done with this one, of course. It will hurt. Except for the needle part. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, my dick! (laughs) 
I didn't even stab you there. I want you to wipe your dinners. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, shut up, Kevin. Goddamn monkey. You drunk ass monkey. Look at that butt. The monkey or your head? I wish I had a butt like that. Okay. Okay. Two bucks. Two bucks. That was a thing too. Like, yeah, there were supposed to be like a variable war rate. And yeah, all that. like a variable rate for everything. In the game is kind of cool. Yeah, but I don't think they ever implemented it. If if they did, it's very subtle. Yeah. I've never seen any. Uh, Shifting of prices or anything that I can well, remember. The only thing that changes is on certain days the the pricing the prices are different. Like if, I think if you play on the Sunday or a Wednesday or something like that, the prices are lower. Something like that. Some weird arbitrary days. Yeah. Same problems for what's actually happening in life now. There's more, you know, paramilitary groups that are just, you know, working for people and they can't be tracked. Like, there's been a whole bunch that are suspected to be uh, Russian oh, yeah. um, that have done a bunch of shit and over in Iran, Afghanistan, you know, Syria, all that kind of stuff. Oh. And, uh,. We can't prove that they're Russian, even though they speak it, you know. Yeah, right. We can't prove that they're Russian bot. They're the... So, like, you know, everyone's like, you guys are bad. I mean, yeah. They're just getting paid to do a job. Yeah. And yeah, you know, there's ID guns. So, yeah, everything that's happening in this... It's happening for real. Yeah, it's actually starting to happen. Holla at your boy. No. Does that mean that you drift in this? <laughs> Good luck. Ah, hey, poop. I mean, you. <laughs> I poop my pants. Good monkey. Goodbye. That dude was weird. Thanks for the gun. <laughs> Sends his life right there. <laughs> Time to kick in the door. Eat the floor. Shoot, shoot all the dinosaurs. I like that part of the cutscene. They have to show him walk out that way. I mean, it's just, it's just good business. What is? This whole, like, uh, art. Artistic. Art. Artsy fartsy. I'm thinking I want pizza, dude. You want pizza? You want fucking pizza, baby? I want some real fucking New York pizza! I want some fucking style pizza! <laughs> I want to see the monkeys do it! I'm gonna dip, dip my, my balls in it. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't it's the same. It wasn't 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 the Stella? Snake, we'll use the Mark II to deal with Drebin from here on out. 
He's what you might call a street vendor. The Mark II can act as You're a street vendor. I'm a delivery boy. Yeah, okay, I know, I know. I yeah, know you guys. know how it works. You know it. You know it. Alright, well next time I mention Strap Chaps, we'll start getting some points on our Costco card. <laughs>